my whole world just changed the first time I saw you. Everything I thought that was important to me just faded away. Nothing's been the same since that first date, and I don't want to spend another moment not being your husband. So would you do me the honor of allowing me to become your husband? I, I don't know what to say. Just say the truth. I'm sorry, is that the word? Verbatim. Okay, she was sobbing everywhere. Damn, you got me crying up in this piece. So it was good? So good? Woo! What the hell was he thinking? Saying, let me think like I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Honestly, it just, it felt perfect. I felt it. I think I'm in the center. Uh, Sorry. I, I think we have the whole aisle. Sorry. Okay, well, when I checked just a moment ago, it said that the seat was still available, though, so... Um... I bought it a few minutes ago. My best friend, she's flying out to New York for the weekend. She sort of got some good news for me, so... Just go to work. <sighs> oh, I'm so sorry. Do you travel light? I actually don't. I had to check in my eight pieces of luggage. How long are you staying there? Just a weekend. That, it's a bit of an overpacking. Not at all. When we go out, we go all out. How old are you? A lady never reveals her age. A lady never, where are your, are, are you allowed to travel alone? Of course! Don't be silly, you silly goose. I like your suit. It's very fashionable. <laughs> very Kenneth Cole. Very <clears throat> circa early 2000s. <laughs> it's brand new. Gosh, no. I wasn't saying it was old. You thought because I said early 2000s, and it's 2018, that I was saying that looks outdated. No, no. I was just saying that this doesn't look like it wasn't made to be worn in our current time. How's that different? This little... So, I'm Dale, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> this is Marcus. Nice to meet you, Dale. And same to you. <clears throat> Mmm, the pleasure's mine. <laughs> oh my gosh, I didn't realize I could be such a space cadet sometimes. Do you need me to switch seats with one of you? <laughs> For what? You can sit next to each other. I need the aisle seat. Well, should we switch that? I need the window seat. Well, I don't understand how this is supposed to work. What are you talking about? I've clearly interrupted your love time together. <laughs> Our love time? Yeah! <laughs> I think it's great, honestly, that more people are putting themselves out there. My brother's like you, too. I'm an ally. Yay! Uh, but, 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 uh, I am not into Dale. And I'm definitely not into Marcus. Guys, guys. I think the country's moving in the right direction on this particular issue. I just proposed to a woman. How'd that turn out for you? She said, <laughs> let me think on it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need your input here right now. And look, you little teenage witch, I have nothing against guys. I love guys, all right? My best friends are guys. I, I'm just, it's just I'm into women. <clears throat> I can attest to it. I'm only 22, and this man was my best man at both my weddings. Both times, he was sitting on the bridesmaid, the guest, the mother. That's right. Look, I don't discriminate against age. Just as long as they're my age or older. The girl that's making him wait so she can. Think on it. He met at my second wedding, right? It took them a while to get it together, but they eventually made it happen. I just love her so much, man. How can she put me on ice like that? I don't get it. I'm a catch. I feel you. I'm perplexed. Uh, Maybe she sees something in you that you can't yet see in yourself. Ooh, that was cold. How is that cold? <laughs> he called me a teenage witch, and you let that go. 
I simply gave an observation on why this woman might be putting on my ice, and now I'm cold? You started off cold. Look, we've got a six-hour flight ahead of us. We can either try to get along, or just ignore each other. Why are you the way you are? <laughs> a strong young woman, you mean? I bet you're alone. I wouldn't be the only one alone. Oh. Oh. Damn, she zigged you on that one. I'm not going to do some joker with the pencil from the Dark Knight stuff with that, are you? She's not going to stab you in the eye with a pencil. <laughs> I'm not going to stab you in the eye with a pencil. Don't be stupid. You need to be stupid with this girlfriend of yours. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know me. You don't know my girlfriend. Why am I explaining myself to some 12-year-old little brat? I'm 16, thank you. I thought you said a lady never reveals her age. I made an exception. Now, I was going to help you with your love troubles. Take some notes, give you a diagnosis. Why would I trust you? Because I have a reputation for helping people in times of love trouble. I'm a vlogger. Yeah. Oh, snap! You're Sabrina from Sabrina the Streets of Love. Can you sit down, please? Oh, huge <laughs> fan. Love your show. Please tell me you do autographs. I do? But only if you sit down. Uh, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Thank you. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I, I didn't recognize you without all the makeup. You really do wear too much makeup on screen, but your advice is always on point. You're the Sabrina. I am she. Huh. I love your show! Oh my god, when you met that guy outside of Gene Kelly's store on the hall, you walk up to him. The governor? He was so messed oh, up! The ghostbooks! And when he broke down and started crying oh, on the side. Oh, I loved her, I loved her, I thought I loved her, I gave her all my heart. Yeah, I, you know, it don't take much for me to cry. Touch me, Bobby. Okay, they're so sweet. Men know how to love their emotions, though. Good men. Good men. Okay, well, since I have you here, there is something that kind of got under my skin back there. What's that? Oh, oh, you remember when you thought Dale and I were, you know... Gay? It's not a dirty word. Yeah, 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 right. It's, it's, um, it's just, Dale said that he's definitely not into me. I just feel like that's kind of <laughs> harsh, yeah? I don't know if we should go there. It's just, you know, why would he be into me? It's, why are you picking that apart? It's just very curious choi word choice, bro. Marcus, we're friends. We aren't into each other. Yeah, but I didn't say I'm definitely not into you. He's taking issue with you using such a strong qualifier. Am I the only one who thinks this is kind of a stupid discussion to be having? <laughs> you want to be with Marcus. I mean, uh, Rosie. <laughs> Rosie will eventually come to her senses and want to commit to you. No end of discussion. Rosie and Marcus committing to marriage will interfere with his time with you? What? <laughs> you and I? We're always going to be us. What? Marcus is saying that no matter what, you guys will always be friends. What? <laughs> you don't have to push me away. You're one of my best friends. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come on. That's fine. That was beautiful. <laughs> thank you for helping. Thank you for helping us move through that. I'm here for you. Playing so still haven't taken off, huh? Now, let's deal with this Rosie issue. All right, hit me. Don't hit yeah, me! What? Yeah. Is, what? Look, I know it hurts to do with wrong motion. <sighs> But love, in any sense of the word, doesn't evolve without some turbulence along the way. Oh, no, 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 no. I am fearful of planes. That is why I sit in the aisle seat every single time, and I don't need you talking about turbulence right now. Okay. Okay? Okay? Right. Okay, you got me all riled up. Calm and down. Oh. It's okay. It's all right. Mm. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to bring up the ears. <sighs> Thank you for apologizing. You're welcome. <laughs> now, 
about Rosie. Tell me everything. Ah, oh, she's a very <coughs> she's a very special woman. <coughs> like Mr. Street Fighter over there said, we met at his second <laughs> wedding. You know, she's into financing. She's a big shot competitor at my company. She's like five nine, terrific body. Great dancer, loves to cook. I mean, so do I. Staying on topic, her, not you. Right, right. You're. So, I'm sorry. It's. It's just you know she's pretty much great at everything she does. Um, does Zumba. Goes hiking. You said pretty much. Oh, good ear. High five for you. Good for me, Sabrina. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I heard that. What are you guys talking about? She is. Pretty much great at everything she does. It's a qualifier. It is not. Your definitely argument? How does it feel to get caught up? I love Rosie. But secretly, you're trying to hold her back. You feel inferior because she has such a strong position in her life and all the things she does. Do not feel inferior. Yes, you do. Look, Mr. Divorce twice before he's 23 years old. Mark it! Hey! We're gonna deal with Dale's issues, with commitment, and his high turnover rate in love later in the plant. We are? <laughs> yeah. I was saving that little nuggy you tossed aside for later. <laughs> Rosie is my heart. I am not insecure. I'm glad you feel that way, but we have a lot to do in a six hour flight. Same. <laughs> <laughs>